a mother has been uh, been congratulated and uh, got a lot of uh, respect from people online since last year, but still is uh, as of now, and uh, her name is uh, Allison Arnold Davis. Uh, she has a son, Drew, who got suspended for five days out of school because he beat up his bully. And normally, uh, when a kid uh, gets uh, suspended uh, from school, uh, parents have uh, would get mad about it. But if, when it comes to bullying, if uh, their son is a victim and they did something in return, maybe something that does happen. And the mother actually. Uh, that's something about it, and you know. she shared it online that uh, about what was going on, uh, what happened that what her son Drew was experiencing at school. So the bully had been bullying. Uh, through since middle school and into high school, so that was quite a long period of time. When Drew told his mother about it, she uh, wrote a letter to the school to uh, do something about it. But even though there was, even if though the bully was also uh, harassing and bullying, uh, making fun of uh, Drew in person, online. And even following it every single day down the hall and take the school did absolutely nothing to do something about it. And even though the bully I've even made threats uh, to him. And also this was captured on video, but school did nothing about that either. Apparently, Drew had uh, also had uh, four classes, which also the bully was also in those four classes. Uh, And the school's uh, response was uh, sign uh, a contract, uh, no contact contract. But of course, that didn't stop him. Uh, the bully from um, the continuous uh, bullying of uh, Drew. And uh, also, the bully was also making fun of uh, his, uh, Drew's dad, and also uh, Drew's uh, younger brother, Jackson, 11 years old. And he decided he had enough, and uh, he uh, threw uh, three punches uh, at the bully, and And since uh, Drew hit the bully, the school, uh, instead of uh, suspending the bully, they suspended Drew for uh, five days. And although uh, uh, one of the bully's friends, uh, he uh, kept quiet about uh, the situation after uh, Drew hit, hit the bully. 
and Bully uh, backed off after uh, he lost. Many people, uh, after hearing this, uh, they also took to social media and also uh, said the school was in, uh, doing a bad thing, was in the wrong, and and with schools, uh, when bullying happens, uh, they don't really seem to do anything about it. When a kid gets bullied, uh, even if they tell the teacher or staff member, uh, they don't really uh, care about it. They don't really do anything about it. And if the kid who gets bullied, uh, if they uh, get hard enough and uh, about enough, and they hit the bully, like maybe they punch them or they kick them or don't they inflict them. Uh, Conduct in any form of way, uh, they blame it on uh, the bully kid and suspend that kid for uh, and get that kid also in trouble. Not just the bully, but you know. And apparently, that has happening in the, so many schools across the, you know, North America. So if you if you if a bully bullies a kid and and a kid doesn't do something about it and not and many uh, parents have also uh, said if a if a bully uh, a kid hits my child my child has the right to hit hit the person back. It's really, uh, schools should uh, really uh, be taking a uh, note uh, because of uh, even that uh, these uh, stuff are uh, showing up online and kids uh, actually doing uh, something about that uh, with the kid, the, the, their bullies and uh, countering back instead of continuing to do it. Uh, be a victim. And of course there's like it's uh doesn't uh, really make sense uh, when a bully who bullied the kid in school The bully kid gets in, also gets in trouble. And actually, the school should be monitoring activity of uh, what the students are doing to each other. And if the kid who's a bully does it too much, or quite a lot, uh, those, those kids should be suspended be the ones who get suspended and too much expelled. And not every kid has the confidence to do something like this. And even the staff members uh, and even teachers should actually be doing something about uh, stuff like this and then instead of just acting like nothing's happening because there are schools uh, a lot of schools that act this way
and only the bu the bullies should be the ones suspended, not the bully kids.